Hey love bugs, this is Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, much love to you. And for my, my returning subs and my extended family, thank you so much for the love and support and the joy that you bring me each and every day through your kind words and your, you know, your good vibes is very, really appreciated. And for that being said, Namaste, much love to you, love and light, love and blessings, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit the notification button, like and subscribe, so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Or if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I would love the chance to get to know you just by you telling me about your spiritual gift or even giving me positive feedback about my video or just, you know, just getting your opinion about the video it would be greatly appreciated or if you feel like you enjoy what you heard and just put a move on you go ahead and spread the word like give me a thumbs up and even share it would be greatly appreciated also and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and today i'm listening to the meditation pure clean positive vibration meditation music for positive energy remove negative thoughts 959 I will post that link in the description box below. And today, uh, my video is about Twin Flame 101 when you're, you're uh, basically when you're assigned, your gift is upgraded. <laughs> it's like Twin Flame 101 when your gift is upgraded. Um, first, uh, the message that I have to put out here. This is something I did not want to do. This is a disclaimer right now. Um, it's a message that has to be put out there. And it's not something that I really like to speak upon because it's like the situation is still fresh. And um, I really don't know much about this person uh, or people that I'm talking about. So it's just like kind of bothersome to me. Um, and I know it has to be told. So it's not nothing that I'm doing to offend anybody or anything like that. It's not a reaction video. I don't do things like that. Um, but it's just need to be told. So um, that's the disclaimer from the beginning. Um, so if I see any kind of negative comments, I'm going to automatically just shut the comment uh, part off and just you just take the message for what it is um, because it's just something I really didn't want to speak upon. But like I said, there was a message that needs to be told and it's been bothering me for the last few days. So, um, it's about uh, basically with all the you know with all the shifts that we're going through and I told y'all we we're going through a lot then you know dealing with my my witch my witch situation with you know <laughs> learning about myself and being able to help people heal and you know send them basically you know towards that way that they need to go to so it's a blessing about it but there's also like there's a downside of you know being an empath like we are we're able to sense a lot of things but with right now what's going on whatever is going on i don't know about you but it's like the things that i've been gifted with has been heightened like my hearing is like <laughs> it, it is it's like really messed up so it's um like I hear everything it's like ringing in my ear and it just feels like even if somebody was to probably blow a dog whistle I'll probably be able to hear that mess that's how bad my senses have just been acting up so a lot of the messages that I've been getting you know like I've um uh, made videos the other day was talking about you know the justice for junior and the situation about uh triple x i don't know how to pronounce the last part so i'm not gonna go ahead and murder that boy's name like that but you know i've been talking about that and i noticed how i've been responding to people's videos it's like things that i wouldn't really say like if you've been watching my videos for a while you know i said love and light all the time but i keep it real and it's just with this situation i really don't know nothing about this boy except you know this is something that my daughters and stuff listen to you know that's around their age because they're in their 20s so it's just like you know when i first heard about him or whatever like i was telling one of my subs um misty that um I think it was either Misty or Joan that, you know, when I first seen him a few months ago and she was telling me about, oh, you know, Triple X, um, 
you know, he's he's one of these good rappers, you know, I, you know, because she has, she deals with, you know, issues or whatever on her own, so I know that he has helped a lot of people on their depression, and, you know, there's a lot of kids to talk about, you know, they, they had suicidal thoughts and stuff like that, so, you know, I knew that he was pushing out a lot of stuff, but then there was, you know, things that was coming about him that was not so nice, so it's like, every time I see him, it's like a vision that's really, you know, it's like if you, you're the type of person that listens to him, because I know there's some people that, you know, that probably watch my videos that also listens to him or whatever, and I know he has made a really, you know, his death has really impacted a lot of people, there's a lot of people still grieving on it, so that's the reason why I'm not really comfortable with doing this video, but it's like there's a message that needs to be told, and it's just like when I see him, for me, being a parent, I guess that's the reason why it really bothers me a lot, because no parent should ever have to bury their kids, they're just, that's just something that, you know, the parents are supposed to die, and, you know, the kids are supposed to take care of stuff like that, but it's something else when a child can, you know, I can look at somebody's child and see him basically say, I'm free, you know, I, and, been that that person that actually had to see the video of him his life was body there and it's just like me having to go through that with my father you know that really hit home especially for you being a parent that's not how you should find out that your child passed away it's just like you know people just put videos out there but when I was had that encounter I just kept on saying you know they miss you they really miss you and the situation that, you know, that has happened, he knew it was going to happen, it's just the way he's been putting out videos from the past, you know, um, I guess it was like a couple of days or something uh, before he had, you know, th that situation that happened, he kept on saying, you know, if he gets sacrificed or if he gets shot, you know, blah, 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 you know, it just became too much for me, I couldn't watch him. You know, it's just seeing that it was like really sad because I was just like, I don't know why this this child particularly is really hitting home for me, even though I felt really bad for his family, but it's just something about him really got to me. And it really made me emotional because I'm just like, they really miss you. And it's just like, you know, I guess he was saying before he passed away, you know, if anything was to happen to him, um, that if people didn't knock down the doors trying to figure out what was going on with him if he's in a hospital it's just like you know that's it you know i'm done and he's he sees the love that people have for him and that's the part that makes him happy but he's not happy about the outcome that made them have to go that way you know that's the part he's not happy about because he knew it was going to happen he just didn't know it was going to happen that way and that's what I keep hearing. He was just like, you know, I knew it was going to happen. I just didn't know it was, was going to happen this way. He knew he was going to be set for an example. But he just didn't know how it was going to play out. So it was like he basically had premonitions about him going through this stuff. And he just said that his life is his life. His music was his music. His music was his truth. But people try to combine those with the two. And he knew how to separate the two. But other people just didn't. So, I don't know if that means anything to anybody, but that just didn't make sense to me because I don't talk like that. <laughs> I don't, I, I mean, he has this proper voice, but it has an ominous thing to it, too, at the same time. So, it was just like, he, 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 he said his life had meaning to it, but his death will have a lot more. So, it's just like, he knew it was going to happen, but he knew he was going to be set an example. And... I don't know why he wanted me to say that, and he, he's just been coming to me saying the darkness, you know, even people see the darkness, they'll see the light through the darkness, or that you'll, you know, it'll be the darkness through the light or something like that, but it was something very deep, and just like, riddle me this or whatever, but, you know, if people know how he talks, he probably, they probably understand what I'm talking about, but I don't, but just to actually see these kids and just know that you know he knew he had to um basically set an example you know he was there for a lot of children that were growing up a lot of teenagers you know some adults you know that actually 
that can relate to him because of the situation that he carried and I can feel that he carried a lot of pain for him. So it's just like he doesn't want y'all to mourn his death. He just wants you to take, you know, take what he he gave you, that gift that he gave you of, you know, keeping y'all, you know, hyped up. Whoever, you know, watched him, he wanted you to be happy. But just to know that his his what he's experiencing now, he's at peace. But he just said since there's another gift that's coming later on that but won't be in the form of him. But it'll be him. People will know it's him. But it won't be in the same form. So I don't know what that means. You know, I was really contemplating on doing this video because it's something I really don't like to speak on because like I said before, I'm not trying to disrespect anybody because I know like my daughter loves this 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 rapper you know he was somebody's son he was somebody's brother you know and then now come to find out he has a child that's supposed to be coming into the world so it's just like really sad that you have to hear these things you know and then i'm dealing with the situation where i keep seeing the boy from you know the justice for junior he worries about his mom a lot so that's just a lot of stuff to deal with so when your 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 senses are heightened just know that anything is prone to happen. <laughs> anything is prone to come through. So you just don't know how things are going to happen. Just know that they're happening. And it's just like lately with all the senseless violence, that is like we're all faded. And we have all we all have a contract for something. And it's just sad that this is what theirs is worth. So um, to all the people that love uh, Triple X, you know, I keep his, his family, him and his family, and you in his prayers, um, knowing there will be justice in whatever this this meeting is supposed to hold on for anybody who's listening that listens to him, but just know that, you know, he still loves y'all, um, and I mean, it's, it's just weird because it's just, you know, he's never came to me, you know, I don't know nothing about him. Um, I just know he was doing a lot of charity work before he had passed, um, and he was just basically trying to turn his life around, and it just happened. So, um, I hope this was able to help anybody that they were able to resonate with that, you know, dealt with this, um, that, you know, you listen to his music. I hope this was able to give you some kind of peace, um, and, uh just like and subscribe even hit this notification bell remember what i said if there's any kind of negative comments come out i will just cut the comments off because it's like it's not all about like trying to get any kind of attention that's not what i was trying to do if there's a message that needs to be said no matter how uncomfortable it is i have to put that aside and go ahead and put this message out so hopefully you were able to enjoy this um well not enjoy it but hopefully you were able to get something out of this video Spread the love, spread the awareness, wake up. We all have to do it someday. So I will talk to you later on a better vibe. And I will <laughs> just peace and love. Bye. <laughs>